Today, in this video, I am going to help you calculate inverter battery backup time using simple to use calculator in few simple steps. You can find the link to our calculator in the video description below. You just require to input appliance load requirement in watts, battery capacity in ampere hour, battery voltage in volts and efficiency of the battery in decimals to calculate battery backup. Let's assume that you have an appliance load requirement of 300 watt and inverter battery with 150 h capacity, 12 volts of input voltage and 80% discharge efficiency. Then your 150 h capacity battery should give you 4.8 hours battery backup time. This way you can easily calculate your inverter battery backup time. If you don't know any of the calculator fields to calculate battery backup, no worries. I am here to help you. Let's discuss each of the calculator fields in detail to help you calculate battery backup time. Number 1. Battery Capacity Battery capacity determines how fast current flows and is measured in ampere hours. Higher ampere hour means electricity flowing quickly through the battery and delivering more power to your appliances. One can find the battery capacity on product description or on the face of the battery. Number 2. Input voltage of the battery The voltage of the battery is unit of potentiality in your battery and is measured in volts. The higher the voltage, the more current flows through the battery and power your appliances. In general, every home inverter battery comes with 12 volts of input voltage. You can find this detail in the user manual or on the product description. Number 3. Appliance Load Requirement Load is the amount of energy required per hour for appliances connected to an inverter and is measured in watts. The watt that each appliance is uses is usually mentioned on the package of the appliance or you can find it on Amazon. To calculate the load requirement, you can use our load calculator provided in the video description below. Let's assume you are connected or planning to connect two ceiling fans of 75 watt each, two tube blades of 20 watt each and one LED TV of 60 watts to the inverter. The total load in this case is 250 watts. In case your respective appliances or corresponding voltages are not covered in the load calculator, then just sum up the watt of all those appliances and input under add more section to calculate the load. Please note that when calculating the load, Consider only those appliances which you have connected to the inverter or planning to use during power cuts by connecting to an inverter. Number 4. Efficiency of the battery Battery efficiency is the amount of energy you get from the battery for consumption relative to the amount of energy you input to the battery. In simple terms, one can't use 100% charge given to the battery as output for powering the appliances during power cuts. Some amount of energy loss is unavoidable during the process of energy discharge. Efficiency percentage varies from battery to battery, which you can find on the product catalog or you can inquire with your manufacturer. In general, one can expect efficiency of 80% from top battery bands like Luminous, Exide, Amaron. I hope now you are aware of calculator fields to calculate battery backup time. Now confidently calculate your battery backup time using link provided in the video description below. And in the same linked page, you can find complete text description of the video and our top recommendations for your battery needs too. Don't forget to check them out. If you find this video helpful, give it a like, subscribe for more helpful videos. Thank you. Have a great day. See you in the next video.